This nuclear power plant with a pair of decades-old pressurized water reactors produces about 20% of the state of Virginia's electricity. The nearly 100 nuclear reactors across the United States will be absolutely essential for the country to meet the goals President Joe Biden has set for greenhouse gas emissions, according to his climate advisor, Gina McCarthy. Now, I don't expect those old ones to be around a long time, but I do expect them to be safe. Um, and I expect them to continue in a way that's going to allow us to keep the greenhouse gas emissions down with, with really stable baseload capacity. Aside from reliability, nuclear power production is relatively compact. The equivalent of a one gigawatt reactor would require numerous solar panels or wind turbines blanketing an area several hundred times bigger than what is needed for a typical nuclear power plant. Dan Stoddard is Dominion Energy's chief nuclear officer. There's not a sufficient recognition of nuclear as being carbon free. So I think that's in part um, on us as an industry to better communicate that, that fact. We have a great story to tell in nuclear. For decades, environmental groups warned about the risks of nuclear power, pointing to accidents at Three Mile Island in the United States, Chernobyl in Ukraine, and Fukushima in Japan. They also raised concerns about where and how to safely store radioactive waste for the long term. Greenpeace, once on the forefront of this, no longer actively campaigns against nuclear power in the United States. The group declined VOA's request for an on-camera interview on the topic, but it did send a statement arguing nuclear energy is both expensive and dangerous, and just because nuclear pollution is invisible doesn't mean it's clean. The group suggests that instead of pouring money into new nukes, the Biden administration should focus on phasing out fossil fuels and investing in the transition to a renewable energy economy. The nuclear industry calls that outdated thinking. These plants, um, approaching some approaching 50 years of operation, have never operated more safely or more reliably in their history. Um, the, the United States nuclear industry has an incredible track record of safe and, and reliable operation. Nuclear plants like this one remain the country's top source of emissions-free power generation. But they weren't designed to last forever, and very few new ones are being built in the United States. Decommissioning too many of them could send Biden's clean energy goals up in smoke. Steve Herman, VOA News, at the North Anna Power Station, in Mineral, Virginia.